Let's take a situation where you are at home, hungry and alone. As a bachelor, I face the situation every day. <laughs> so I open the fridge and I find that I have a lot of ingredients, but everything is in small amounts. So what I do is I take a bowl and then I add 50 grams of onions, 50 grams of spaghetti that I find in one corner, 50 grams of broccoli, 50 grams of schlagzana, and I bake it, and I make the, the most beautiful auflauf ever. <laughs> now, you must be wondering, why do I have to learn auflauf from this guy when my mother makes the best auflauf in the world? Mixing five or more ingredients together actually increases the randomness of a system as compared to, let's take spaghetti carbonara, where spaghetti is in a large amount and bacon, egg, and cheese are added in small amounts to enhance the taste of the spaghetti. Okay, so you have not signed up for a cooking class. Here comes the science. Metallurgists have designed material alloys traditionally just like the spaghetti carbonara, where you have one base metal like iron and steel, nickel in super alloys, and so on, and other elements are added in small amounts to enhance the properties of these base materials. On the other hand, mixing five or more metals together in equimolar ratios, just like our auflauf, increases the randomness of atoms sitting around each other. And increase the, increasing the randomness of atoms in thermodynamic terms is called high entropy. So the Auflauf set of alloys are called high entropy alloys. <laughs> now, the point is, why use them? Increasing the entropy has shown excellent properties, especially at very high and very low temperatures as compared to the same materials designed like the spaghetti carbonara. And just like your Auflauf, you tweak things here and there to match your tastes, like you add equal amounts of tomato to make it more juicy, or you add equal amounts of cheese to make it more cheesier, the same thing can be applied to high entropy alloys. Now, next time you go to the kitchen, and now that you know the secret of making a high entropy food, try mixing everything in equal amounts around you until you get that exotic unknown taste and it may smell so good that there may be a knock on the door and you open the door and there you find Gordon Ramsay. <laughs> Thank you so much.